What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Steven. This is Steven in Stereo and in today's video we're going to be checking out Louis Tomlinson live on Jimmy Fallon doing Silver Tongues. I'm so excited. I love this album. Faith in the Future is so great. I did a full uncut album reaction to that over on Patreon as well as Louis Tomlinson's um, Zach Sang show interview about Faith in the Future. I've done a ton of content related to Louis Tomlinson over on Patreon. So if you guys want to check that out, link is in the description. But I'm so proud of what he's done with this album. So I'm really looking forward to today's video because we're going to get a chance to see this track, which is so fucking good. We're going to get a chance to see it live. And I think it's really important because Louis Tomlinson at this moment in his career is definitely at his best that we've ever seen him. So I'm so excited about this. Huge shout out to Ryan over on Patreon for requesting this video. Thank you so much for your support. All that out of the way, let's check out the Sass Master from Doncaster. Silver Tongues from his new album, Faith in the Future. Please welcome Louis Tomlinson. Get high on the amber wave. Going deep for the ones that do the same. Air yeah, maxes and silver tongues. Settling for another heavy one. Settling Damn, his vocal control. I'd choke when you smoke got in my eye. Bad logic and empty cans. I know nobody understands. Okay, I'm obsessed with where he's at vocally. You can hear it so much in, in a live performance like this. Like, obviously, you're going to hear it on, on record. You get a lot of chances to, to do that. You're in the best possible setting to make your vocals sound amazing, right? But in a live performance, it's also really important to be able to nail those notes. And just to hear how perfect that tone is all throughout this really shows what we've been talking about for the last couple of months, which is that his dedication to building up that talent, continuing to work with a vocal coach, continuing to push himself further and further. It's paid off so much. And you hear it right here. Me like you do. No times like these, so much happier. Nights like these, we'll yes. I'm also just stoked for him being able to play that like alternative rock that he's wanted to play. Yes. Oh man, it's so fucking good live. Oh, the harmonies. Let's go. Oh man, it's got a little bit of like a Ramon sound to it in that in that chorus. Yes. Oh man. It's got like all of the best fucking influences from like the mainstream punk, like pop punk sort of movement. So fucking sick. Like such a good riff live. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Those eyebrows. He gives you the. This is fucking so good live. You can tell that they wrote this song to hit hard live. 
because on the record it's great but it doesn't hit as hard as it does when they play it live oh fuck yes oh I'm so fucking stoked that he has a band that can like bring the energy that he's been wanting you know watching that Zack Singh interview sh like told me a lot about his musical preference and what he really wanted to be making and so it's so fucking cool to hear him being able to make that you know pop punk influenced alternative rock influenced um pop rock influenced music that he wanted on walls we had a couple of tracks like that obviously but like there was like a lot more of an emotional side to that where it was more focused on those pieces of it and for all intents and purposes incredible fucking album right with faith in the future with him you know being a little bit more confident in choosing what kind of music he wants to be making we are getting performances like this like in the Zack Sang interview, he said, with Faith in the Future, we wrote this because we wanted to write an album to tour on. Uh, you know, I'm paraphrasing. That's essentially what he said. And like, you can feel it here. He loves performing live and getting a chance to have songs that allow you to have this kind of presence and this kind of energy. You can't fucking beat that. There's something so special about that connection between him and this sort of genre. And we heard it numerous times. Um, there's a couple of songs that I can't wait to hear live in my like when he tours one of them is this song i of course bigger than me out of my system those songs are going to hit so fucking hard live and this is a really great preview of that i'm so glad that he's working with a band and like they all seem to like vibe off of each other and they all kind of understand what the what the bigger sound is going to be um with everything because it brings so much momentum into the music and this is honestly just an incredible moment i'm so stoked for him he sounds incredible here even with a track like this that i feel like if we were watching this um performed on tour he would allow a little bit more rasp in the voice he would allow a little bit more energy to come out because obviously like you're interacting with the crowd right you want like everything to be like going off but i love that he can take the song into a you know live tv performance and be able to like really focus in on the vocals making sure that all of those notes are perfect because honestly when we see him on tour i don't need that i he could shout the lyrics i don't care like it'd just be cool to be in the room with him right but on tv this is a chance to you know introduce new people to you and like the fact that he's able to present his voice in this way that's fucking amazing that's a huge step for him so i'm so stoked i love faith in the future i love where louis tomlinson is at i cannot wait to see what else he does moving forward because the promo has been amazing the album hit number one in the uk there's just so many incredible pieces coming together for him and it's everything that he deserves honestly he's worked his ass off for it so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video make sure to check out patreon if you want to support the page i don't do ads or sponsorships um so all the money that i make uh to continue to do this comes from my patron subscribers so thank you so much huge shout out to ryan for requesting this i love you i will see you guys in the next one peace